His day ended like it began. As early as 8 a.m., Kenyan colors brightened an otherwise cold Dutch day. Solidarity songs interrupted a sleepy morning at The Hague with Kenyan official after Kenyan official joining. With each passing moment, the number of observers grew. <laughs> Journalist Joshua Sang, himself facing charges at the criminal court, was also here. <laughs> and for a brief second, he became the subject of interest. After two hours of joyous waiting, President Uhuru arrived shortly before 10 a.m. Those eight steps still problematic as the president made his way to the entrance of the court. The huge crowd settled into the public galleries, more observers made their way to the court and they were all turned away. The galleries were full. It would be another four hours before the ICC steps came alive again as the president left for his hotel. <laughs> president Uhuru Kenyatta walked out of the International Criminal Court. He could hardly stand still. The crowd around him was swollen and they were eager to hear him speak. Maneuvering down the eight steps at the entrance of the court, however, proved a tall order. Government officials, Kenyan observers.